there were three big areas that we talked about. Number one was the need to really get to an economic cooperation agreement between our two countries, uh, you know, really get the, the bilateral trade agreement done. Uh, the second is the need to foster innovation and to create regulatory uh, frameworks in each country and between the countries that actually encourage innovation. And then the third was to really think through the implications of this digital transition that we're all going through. And we really spent a lot of time talking about important issues like cybersecurity, data privacy, cross-border data flows, and uh, encouraging our governments to actually take an active role in policy and regulatory uh, decision-making that uh, actually allows us to move forward on all the benefits uh, of this transition. Speaking of strengthening U.S.-Japan commercial ties, what area in particular do you think American and Japanese companies can collaborate on? Well, I think that American and Japanese companies can come together in ways that uh, really enhance technology use. Uh, if you think about partnerships that we have here, like what we've done with FANUC, and actually connecting the robots in a manufacturing facility for purposes of things like preventive maintenance, but then over time driving more intelligence into the process. Uh, we have uh, artificial intelligence, robotics, uh, machine learning, and so many new technologies that are just natural fits for you know, the, the Japanese technology affinity and the innovation that can also come from the U.S. So I think there's lots of areas we can partner together. How can technology and innovation be a force for good and fewer economic transformation? And one of the things that I'm most excited about with all the great technology that is being uh, invented and delivered around the world is that when you, when you look at what's available now, I think that we're at a point in time where we can actually tackle some of the biggest problems that exist in the world. You know, we talked about Society 5.0 and the Sustainable Development Goals and you know, the technology has such an important role to play in helping actually achieve those goals. So uh, not only are there great productivity, it's a great productivity value from the technology, we can help our customers be more competitive, but I truly believe that technology is at a point where we can leverage it to really solve some of the biggest problems in the world.